Hey everybody, we're going to install this uh, Jokiro Wi-Fi Retrofit Smart Lock. And um, this appears to be a pretty nice smart lock. You can use it with uh, your uh, Google Assistant and you can use it with Alexa and it will open your door. You can also use it with the keypad on the outside, a fingerprint, um, and also from your smartphone. So we're going to go ahead and install this. We'll do a quick little video on the installation steps and then uh, show you how so it works. This is a deadbolt lock. So the first thing I like to do when replacing a deadbolt or when doing something to the inside of a deadbolt is take a piece of tape and put it on the outside of the deadbolt. That's the key side of the deadbolt. And the reason for that is you don't want this to necessarily fall out on you as you're trying to work on it. So we've got that taped in now. And the next step is going to be to take a Phillips screwdriver and remove the inside handle of the door lock. And what that will leave you with is the prong sticking out here. Now, now for our next step, unscrew the plate to the opposite side. this backing plate installed, take a color-coded extension piece and place it onto the part that's sticking out here. And you should, at that point, freely be able to open and close your deadbolt. Then we're going to take the door lock itself and place it over the top. And then there's two small screws that we're going to put in each side here. Now we're going to put the battery in and it just drops right down in like that. Put the cover plate over the top. And this portion is done. So for the next step, we're going to install the door sensor. This sensor can be done a number of ways. They supply two of them. This one we decided to just put on the exterior. You can also drill a hole in the door casing and, and have it be flush on the inside if you'd like. But for our purposes, we did this one. It has a sticky backing on it. Also, you can put two screws in here to hold it sturdy and then put the cap on. Now, following the instructions in the app, and the app will walk you all the way through it to unlock the door, or to lock this door, this door is now unlocked. To lock the door, we're just going to hold the button down for three, any button down for three seconds. And now the door is locked. And if you look on the app, it will show you that your door is locked. And then to open the door, we're going to just dial the code in that we put in there and hit the check mark and the door is now unlocked. It's real simple. It can be done in um, probably about 15 minutes to do the whole thing, the install and everything. It's a good product, sturdy product, and uh, we give it a thumbs up.